In every five year, there is a grand Buddhist festival of Samayak celebrated in Nagbahal, Patan where all the larger icons of Dipankar Buddha and other important deities are brought for almsgiving. A noble family of Patan named Burabharad fell into poverty. He used to collect balls of cow dung from the streets, store in his treasury and lock it, so that no one could see it. Out of shame that his wife married from Bhaktapur might see it, he used to hide the key. One day when he went to the Bagmati River to take a ritual bath, he forgot to hide his key. His wife found it and opened the treasure out of her curiosity. She saw all the balls of cow dung as golden balls. She became afraid and quickly locked the treasure. When her husband came back from the bath she told what had happened and questioned to her husband why were they living as so poor whereas they had so much wealth in the treasure. Burabharata did not believe the story told by his wife and opened the treasure. As treasure was opened, he saw that all the balls of cow dung that he collected had turned into gold. He thought that the god was very kind to him. Thus, he decided to perform some religious duties to show his respect to the god. He was a Buddhist and his wife was a Hindu. Thus, both started arguing which god they might worship. The wife insisted his husband to worship Narayan, the Hindu god, whereas the husband argued for the Buddha to worship. Finally they concluded their argument to alternately cultivate Asian butterfly bush in the name of Buddha and basil in the name of Narayan, and they would worship the corresponding deity, depending upon which of the plants would spring up first. They did so and the Asian butterfly bush sprang up first. The wife became convinced by this act. Both of them worshipped the Buddha and started the Samayak festival in Patan, an almsgiving Buddhist festival, inviting the icons of Dipankar Buddha Tara and the Vajrakarya priests after establishing a trust. <laughs>